going to be another video that's going to be a video about Empire on Galactic Survival, but now in this video we will be less talking about the general stuff. Yeah, that's not going to be reviewed, that's going to be just general gameplay. Yeah. And let's start the game. The game is starting really fast, we don't have to wait very long, like in some games there are a lot of stuff loading and we have to wait a minute or two. Now just click resume game, load game and we are in. So it's really simple to launch a game, load your safe and enjoy it in your free time of course. And right now there are many changes, <laughs> many changes but not in the game, I mean in our base. The base I'm building with my friend Matty, uh, or in English I, I should say Matthew, uh, we, we have done a, a lot of changes. There's the, there's the prototype of the Phantom, yeah, that's not even finished ship, a uh, small vessel, but it has already a name, because the name is the most important part of the ship, right? Yeah, it can fly right now, but it might soon. You can see the core. It was moved from the bottom of the ship where it appears normally. It was here, right there. And the good thing is to hide your about hiding your core very well and protecting it is that when you lose it, you can't fly on your own ship. It's always nice to have one spare core in your in your AQ, but uh, well, just protect it well and you won't have any problems. There are two fuel tanks, there are two generators on the left and right side, and nothing much else, and the seat for me, yeah, looks comfortable, but the seat like that is a little bit creepy, that's what I think, that's like a seat uh, as the dentist, yeah, and, uh, well, that's going to be uh, something else, I'm not sure what exactly, but that's the landing place for the small vessels. Maybe that will be for the capital vessel, but I, I don't think so. Capital vessels are huge. And now they can land on planets. That's very great. That's the first floor. First or second? I don't know, because in some countries, when you say first floor, uh, it's... It means a higher one, not not the one at the normal level. So that's what they would say in Russia, for example. Uh, no, no, in Poland, I mean. In Russia, they would say that this is the second floor. Yeah, I'm lost, but anyway, uh, we don't have here anything much. You know, just the windows with nice views. Yeah, right there, there's the some something that we already uh, cleared and uh, harvested and there are many drones, creatures, aliens and stuff and some nice containers with loots there's the beautiful forest and oh yeah that's the entrance that looks pretty nice and the views are really great in my opinion I like it and there we go with the stairs to be uh, first floor I don't know how do you say it anyway okay we need to put some fuel packs from hydrogen and power our generator oh not much energy left and uh, I moved the generator in the other position than normally it stands on the ground and the thing that annoys me is that it's a little bit too high. I can't put it lower because the game doesn't let me, so it's a little bit too high in that place, but then just a small thing. We've got here food processor fridge, another fridge bigger, tier 2, uh, fuel tanks, that's the clone chamber. It means when I die I can spawn here in my base. That's the core. I'm thinking about moving it somewhere else because here it's not protected. Well, there is no many freeze that can destroy it, but still, it's good to protect your core. Yeah, that's the cargo box and another one for some basic stuff. That's the oxygen station. 
they changed it really before it was looking similar to the clone chamber you was just entering it and uh, refilling your oxygen but now the only thing you have to do is click and it, it will refill I really like that and of course there are small oxygen tanks you need to put their oxygen bottles where is it where is it it's right there yeah uh -huh. okay that's how it works uh, we've got here oh my Hyperion V1.1 that's my hover vessel it has finally a name and it's going to be really changed soon now that's the medic station just enter it and it refills your energy slowly that's the cargo box for the medicines and stuff like that drugs okay and that's the small ammo box we are holding here some weapons but it's mainly for the ammunition used by used by that lovely turret well it has no ammunition at the moment and I'm not sure why because I don't recall any drones attacking our base but still still I don't know why and we've got here not a nice view from the landing uh, spot okay but there's the large constructor advanced that's the advanced constructor, haven't used it yet not sure how it works exactly but it's much better than the large constructor okay be right back in a second okay everyone I'm back and that's quite everything from my base there's nothing much uh, more to show you uh, we've got some vegetables canned in so it's going it has really long perish time as you can see not as high as the food as raw meat uh, besides that I'm hungry so I'm going to prepare food for myself I'm going to get grilled steak yeah uh, and you can see a lot of purified water oh my god that's hell they need to lower the amounts of water being produced that's my opinion <laughs> with that amount of water we could probably you know uh, give one bottle for every child in Africa oh god I'm joking right now that's just a, a few thousand but if one man can produce so many bottles I don't know how many bottles can produce let's say uh, a few hundred people you can see we are producing oxygen and hydrogen bottles and there's the water generator it produces water jugs and uh, more or like it collects the water and then you can um, make out of it uh, water purified water well I think that I'm just going to get the large fuel packs from that we don't need any more oh that's the normal fuel pack okay can't click like that sadly have to move them manually okay we can leave it here and uh, yeah that will still produce some more water but we don't have to power up it anyway we have already too much water and we don't know what to do with it okay what are the plans for this base the plants are on the basement yeah somehow somewhere we want to build a basement uh, I was thinking about making entrance somewhere there you know, yeah. I don't know moving that clone chamber to the other place you know just below the uh, below the uh, here but I'm not sure to be honest ah <sighs> and we put on the stairs, something like that and... ok, let's go for a ride oh, it's sometimes that a little bit lagging, stuttering oh, there, that's it, Oleg and Mati 
our names on the base. That's really great to have something like that. And let's jump into the uh, Empire. No, no, Empire is again. That's the Hyperion. Uh, very similar names, but not sure if you know Hyperion is one of the books, uh, fantasy books. Okay, that's much better than inside the cockpit, inside the ship. Oh yeah, where are we going? We're heading for the, let's take a comfy planet. Tron base, Epsilon Outpost, we were already there in these two places. Uh, silicon, we have a lot of silicon, Prometium, Ion, I think we need some more Ion. Okay, so we are heading for the Ion Deposit, or more like Ion Ore, not Deposit, I'm not sure. It's very close to our base, so it's really nice, and the, and the ore is really huge, almost. 7,000 Oh, and the amount of the left ion we already were digging there You can see that 86% left right there Oh god uh, Did I eat this grid stick? I Well, I think so I was really in need of the food, now I have some more So that's not bad, okay I was thinking about the landing gear for my hover vessel uh, They have added some I think As I remember well Okay So we are here, let's jump in Okay, someone was calling to the doors uh, One trick guys, that might be helpful for you When you are taking in this game You can left click, you can right click uh, The one is more accurate for like digging holes, little tunnels, something like that but when you click both at the same time it's digging much faster and you're not losing more ammunition or, or stuff like that you get the same amount of the ores of the iron so that's really great I think well, it was not meant to be like this to be honest they haven't fixed that yet so I'm still using it and I like it because digging is not the most excited, uh, not the most exciting thing in this game. blueprint here it is Avenger and that's really great thing and it requires a lot of resources over 2000 iron I've already collected you know all of the copper silicon neodium I have problems with this collision and arrest room but cobalt and iron won't be a problem so for these two other resources uh, we need, we'll need to move to the other planets or maybe asteroids, who knows or maybe raid some bases for the... Uh, some alien bases so we'll find there in containers some great great resources <laughs> yeah okay, I think that's enough digging for now we won't be digging whole episode Okay, oh, that's the place where I was getting out of the hole. Yeah, sometimes it's causing really big troubles to get out of the huge hole. Okay, where is my Hyperion? There it is. Okay, let's jump in. And let's check the planet. I think we still have a lot of things to discover on the planet, like here, I mean, somewhere there, there's nothing discovered. So for that we'll need to head more to the left. To the left, to the left. Okay. 
And let's go scavenging. Traveling. Oh, no, no, no. Why I did turn off my engines. Oh, God. Oh, there's the corn dog. You can eat them, so that's why I stopped. Just to eat one. And I'm sure I will find more in mountains. So, let's say I need food, I will just collect some of them. Oh yeah, climbing mountains with hover vessels is really very difficult. But it's possible. Okay. Let me just grab really fast some of corn dogs. Uh, are there some anymore? Uh, I don't think... I don't see anymore. But I'm sure they are. So I won't be hungry. No. I won't have... I will not have to come back to the base for food or hunt. Yeah. Uh, where am I heading? Oh god. What, what is it? Cone center. Well, I discovered that and I think I didn't visit it with my friend yet. So, I guess we'll have to... Oh god. Looks like a... Oh! Get... Oh god. Get out of here. We'll land here. And we'll destroy the drones. Okay. reload <laughs> sorry sorry oh yeah come over come over my friend I'm not going to run over there from loot come on come on yeah come here very very good oh don't shoot my ship oh 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 I'm falling Oh yeah, get tracked. Oh, it's shooting, it's shooting. What's the... Oh god, okay. Oh, run, run. Oh god, oh god, oh god. God, run, run, yeah, here we are, safe, oh, what the hell is it, I think there's something, oh god, oh god, oh god, Cannon drop. That was you, bitch. That's the place I'm going to save and, and wait for my friend to come over. I'm not going there alone. Thanks everyone for watching. Obviously I'm not going to get there alone. Because that's going to be a really hard job.